Hi, I'm Kristen Burt for Red Carpet Report. Tonight we're at FITM for the opening of the 11th Annual Outstanding Art of Television Costume Design. We were just talking with Anne about you know creating. I know. What's it like? You know, obviously, for actors, wardrobe is absolutely everything. Uh, so you know, of course, Anne was one of the first uh, members of the Shield family that I met. So when I come in for my fitting, and uh, she, she, I had come off another show where I was riding motorcycles called Harley and the Davidsons, and so they were like, okay, we have to customize this leather jacket for you, and we have two days to do it, and we have this amazing leather smith's going to get it done, but. Um, you know, your size is like, actually, they just fit me for a different jacket, for this other thing. I can bring it to you. So I bring him this, like, red leather jacket. This kind of looks like the jacket from Thriller. Oh, I love that. It's so iconic. <laughs> and, uh, and so they, you, they, I gave it to him, handed it over, and then a day later, she comes up, she brings me this, and I'm just like, oh, my God, this is, uh, I mean, it looks like it was ripped from the book, and, um, which is great because I tried, I wanted to make sure that we adhered as strong as we could to the story and Felipe Smith's uh, character and... And, uh, and I see it and I try it on and, and it's exactly as they say, you know, it's just, it's not until you really put the costume on that you really feel like you're the guy, you know, and it all just snapped into place. It's cool. That is so cool. And, you know, I was asking Anne too, you hear from the fans when they think, if they don't think something's right or perfect. Yeah, what did you hear when, it, yeah, I know, right? Yeah. What did you hear when they saw what uh, Ghost Rider looked like? You know, like? like they were, everyone, you know, there's a lot of worry and trepidation and, you know, everybody wants it to all they want is if it should be great. They're rooting for you. They want you to win. They want you to succeed in making it as real as possible. And um, but if you don't, they'll be they'll eviscerate you and they'll in a moment. So uh, you know we we had been really buttoned up about a lot of it and hadn't shown a lot of it to anyone. And then uh, I think Entertainment Weekly had put out the first image of me in the costume. And then all all of a sudden it was just kids lining up these like uh, comic to live action. Uh, pictures that they were putting together they were just like it's so good it's so accurate it's like up and down it's Robbie Ray's and I was just so proud because that was the first time anyone saw it and uh, and they all they all bought in so it was good I think I would have been sweating a little bit until that first image came out even yeah. though you're, you're not creating it you're creating the character but right. at the same time you're like Whoosh, we did it absolutely I mean that, you know that that was you know we still had a lot of work to be done but uh, we were in the process of doing that work and we all felt like it was going well and that we were making something cool and and sure enough, that's how it was received, and we're very thankful for that. But we owe a great deal to everyone's uh, 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 need and desire to just be accurate, comic accurate, and that's straight up with Anne right there. Uh, yeah, I mean, it's, it's always great for people to understand, too, how collaborative a process it is and how we all need everything from lighting to costume Including designers. The people here at the, uh, the Fashion Institute, they were so uh, uh, collaborative. Like, for instance, these shoes... It's important that the tongues are worn on the outside of the pants. That was something that I, that I decided I thought was cool, and that Ann thought thought was cool. And and uh, they sent me a picture earlier of this uh, the, of this exhibit, and, and the shoes they were all tucked into the jeans. I was like, no, 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 they have to be pulled up over near, over the top. And they accommodated that, and they made sure it was it was uh, that was as it was intended to be. So I love that. It's like it's check amazing. nailed it. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> all right, well, great talking yeah, with nice you. Talking to you too. So Thank fantastic you. to see this live and in person. Great. Yeah. Thank you. You bet. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe to our channel, like this video, and in the comments below, let us know what you think the best dress show on TV is.